God bless you. God bless you. This message is also pre-recorded. <laughs> Hallelujah. Now, the reason people leave your church. Notice I didn't say Jesus church. I said your church. Notice I did not say Jesus church. I said your church. Now Psalm said, some in church, some ignorant in church. And I understand their point. Say, well, don't 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 talk against the against the leader. You don't want to cause weak people to turn away from a church. If we don't tell the truth, weak people is going to turn away from a church. And turn away from God and everybody else. If we don't tell the truth. We got to tell the truth. For even though they're looking all on the outside. So they will know that there is a difference. And holy and unholy. And what God requires. And what your pastor ain't doing. Oh, they got to know. Oh, don't say nothing. And they come in among us, my God, and they see all the foolishness and the false doctrine and the false prophets and corruption going out. And they'll think it's all right because you said it was all right. Sometimes they come to you. Oh, just pray it, just pray it. No, you better say it's wrong. You better open your mouth and say it's wrong. It ain't right what Bishop doing. It ain't right what Pastor doing. You better open your mouth and say it ain't right. It's not right. All right. You got to step before God one day. You ain't got to step before the pastor. You got to step before God. These up say, well, why, why, why are you sitting on that kind of leadership? Honey, you ain't sitting on that kind of leadership. How can two walk together except they agree? If you don't agree with it, you better open your mouth and say it ain't right. If you don't say nothing, you agree with it. If you don't say nothing, you agree with it. And you let the world know and that ungodly false prophet here about church of God and Christ, apostolic, Baptist, Methodist, Episcopal, pastor, know that you agree with it. And you see they prayed and said how anointed they are. How they are God-fearing leader. You know there ain't no God fearing leader bringing false prophets among you and got all kind of money game being played all in the church and ungodly going on and false doctrine they teach it. They ain't God fearing. But you see they pray. I've been in services where, where people are rah rah. Ooh, the bishop, oh, he, he God fearing. He fear God. I know he don't. I don't say a word. I say, I don't say nothing. Because I know he don't fear God. I'm not saying he fear God. I'm not rah rah about that. I have introduced some pastors and bishops. And I know they didn't fear God. I didn't introduce them as that anointed God fearing person. Because I know they don't fear God. <laughs> it's a difference. Uh huh. Well, what you see there, well, we have no fellowship with those false prophets that don't fear God. We have no fellowship with those presiding bishops and jurisdiction of bishops and elders and district elders. And we, we have no fellowship with them. And they don't fool with us. They don't fool with us. And we speak against what they're doing. Publicly. And we teach against what they're doing. But we fellowship with the saints. Those ain't saints. But they're among us. We fellowship with the saints. We mark them. We mark them. We don't have nothing to do with them. We mark them. Uh-huh. Yeah, we mark presiding bishops. 
and local pastors and superintendents. We mark them, put a mark on them. They call the vision contrary to a doctrine of Christ. We mark them and we don't have no fellowship with them. They don't fool with us. You got me. Get ready to go. I'm getting ready to go minister right now. They don't fool with us. They, by God, they don't fool with us. In, in, in a lot of cases, I heard what, uh, say, so you ain't got to worry about leaving the world alone. The world going to leave you alone. The world leaves church is going to leave you alone. They, they ain't going to fool with you. Actually, they gonna mark you. They gonna say you speak against leadership. You don't show no love. You don't show no mercy. You don't show no grace. You judge. You think you know everything. You think everybody right, but you. Oh, they gonna mark you. But some leave your church because of all their ungodliness. I say your tent. But we fail here with the body of Christ. We don't fail here with fall. It's fall prophet that it's a fall prophet here in Memphis. Supposed to run the revival at the first of the year. I've already made it known I'm not attending one night. I don't fail here with fall prophet. I don't care if you get up, fall out, and roll out. You got to be holy. Holiness is still right. That's enough. God bless you.